Hello A-listers, today's video is a routine showing you how I get ready for a very romantic and sensual date night. So this video is sponsored by Confessions of a Rebel. Thank you so much to Confessions of a Rebel for partnering with me. And I'm going to be talking to you so much more about this scent that I received called Get a Room. But without further ado, let's go ahead and hop right in to my date night preparation. I like to start out with my five-step oral hygiene routine and that routine, just to get it out of the way, it consists of floss, mouthwash, tongue scrubbing, brushing my actual teeth, and then using a whitening mouthwash or a whitening rinse afterwards. So those are the five steps and I have a more in-depth um, five-step routine um, where I list out the products that's over on my Instagram in my highlights under living alone diaries and it's also here on my channel so after I brush my teeth I like to move right on to washing my face I wash my face for 60 seconds um, I follow the 60 second rule that was demonstrated by LA Beautyologist and the soap that I use or the cleanser that I use is nothing special it's just a very basic cleanser where it doesn't like irritate the skin um, it's just super gentle and literally all it does is cleanse I like to do that because I've been using some medicated products from my dermatologist on my skin to help me kind of combat my adult acne um, and the hyperpigmentation that will follow after the breakouts that occur from the adult acne so these products seem to be working so I don't like to use a cleanser that's too harsh just because I want to make sure that my face products that I got from my dermatologist and also from my esthetician I like to make sure that those work and it's not over complicated and at the end of my skincare routine I like to slather on a heaping amount a very generous amount of SPF this is specifically SPF 50 and then I apply a lip mask this is going to add so much moisture to my lips I absolutely love this lip mask so moving on I like to remove the leg hair that I have um, I've tried laser I've tried waxing I've also tried shaving I prefer to use hair removal cream um, this is something that I can use in a pinch I just apply a little bit of baby powder on my legs first to prep it so it doesn't really irritate my skin um, this hair removal cream contains aloe so it doesn't further irritate my skin and I just massage that into my legs and then my upper thigh I stop about mid thigh but just massage it in really really well leave it on for about five to ten minutes and then I take a rag and before I start my shower water I just rinse it off with this cloth so that's it I don't do this too too often um, I do this when I don't feel like shaving <laughs> gotta be honest and it leaves your legs like silky silky smooth so the next thing that I do again before I turn the shower on is apply an exfoliant so once I've massaged the exfoliant this is um, a textured exfoliant so it's not like a chemical one this is a more physical exfoliant more like a body scrub it's a coffee scrub to be exact I scrub that all over my skin my hair hands my arms my stomach my legs everywhere then I apply my exfoliating gloves just slip those right on and I use a bar soap this is specifically a papaya soap it's from a black owned skincare company I absolutely love this I just lather my entire body twice and then I get out of the shower so now I'm applying a body butter that I also picked up from a black owned skincare company love 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 this so the scent is pearls and lace I'm not really sure if you can imagine that, but it pairs perfectly with my Confessions of a Rebel perfume. So I love to use their body butter and their body cream. And it's kind of like, you know how you like layer perfumes on top of one another. I like to use the fragrance of my body butter and my body cream as a layer. And then it brings out that Confessions of a Rebel get a room so much more. So I massage that into my skin because I actually have 
skin that like leans more to the dry side so my face is more combination it's more dry than it is oily but my skin for sure is dry so I personally love to slather on these products massage these products in really really well get every inch crack crevice I love to really get all oiled up in this body cream in this body butter the body butter is first then the body cream is second and this really prepares me for my fragrance so this is the star of the show confessions of a rebel get a room so it's basically a base of forbidden apple layered with mandarin and it has stripped down woody notes it's a very sensual medley of vanilla praline it has a touch of spice and honestly this is such a sexy scent. The key notes, if you need the notes of the scent to be able to identify it, would be apple tree, mandarin, cypress, vanilla, and clary sage. So this is actually a very traditionally feminine scent, but men love it too. So it's a unisex scent. It can be used that way at least. I personally love to spray it on my wrist, on my ankles, and on my collarbone. It lingers. It follows you. It like seeps into your skin, works with your body chemistry. I absolutely love this scent and I think you will too. So make sure to use my coupon code to get 20% off of your Confessions of a Rebel fragrance. The link is down below in my description box. Moving on to makeup, I'm going to do my typical soft glam look. Um, this is my typical full coverage look as well. I love to just add brown eyeshadow to the lids, liner, fluffy lashes. I'm going to be applying nude gloss. It's a very, very like quick and easy look for me to achieve. If you would like to see it in depth, I'll have some videos linked in the cards uh, for your viewing pleasure. And then I like to take my like head wrap down and my other head wrap down because I do have on a lace wig and fortunately it's glued down. Um, what I'm gonna do is take these two braids out you see in the front after I comb out my baby hair. So I'm going to touch those baby hairs up and then take the braids down in the front, add a little bit of water, leave-in conditioner, a little bit of gel, and um, then we're going to get dressed. The dress that I'm wearing is so sexy, and then I'm pairing it with my YSL heels and a little black purse, so it's an all-black affair. Here I am. Honey, hold your applause. I had to come out of my room because the Confessions of a Rebel get a room. It needs its own entrance i look amazing i feel amazing and most importantly i smell amazing i have become so addicted to the compliment you smell so good what are you wearing and confessions of a rebel has gotten me stopped multiple different times on a couple of different date night occasions people asking me what perfume i have on so highly recommend confessions of a rebel again thank you so much to confessions of a rebel for partnering with me and sponsoring this video don't forget to visit the link in the description box down below and use my coupon code to get your very own bottle of confessions of a rebel and i'm telling you you're going to need to get a room but until next time stay beautiful i love you goodbye Mwah.